Good morning. Welcome to Barcelona, the capital city of the Catalonian region in Spain. I thought it would be nice to end season one of our European tour in the country where we started it, Spain. And today I'm going to attempt to do the impossible, that is to explore Barcelona in just a day. There's obviously so many sights to see and so many things to do here in Barcelona that it's hard to pack them all in one day. But a man can try. So let's start here at the bottom of La Rambla where you can see the, the statue of Christopher Columbus and then make our way towards uh, La Sagrada Familia. This is La Rambla. This is normally quite busy, but early morning on a Sunday, I guess not. <laughs> this is actually my second time in Barcelona. First time I came here, I was a lot younger, much, much younger. <laughs> I'm now in the Gothic Quarter, which I believe is the oldest part of the city. In front of me is what used to be called Catedral de Barcelona, but they've changed the name now to Samsung Galaxy Z. Next to the uh, Catedral de Barcelona is this sign that says Barquino. That used to be the name of Barcelona. That's what the Romans called it when they you know, started the city. It's half nine in the morning and the place still looks deserted. I'm not sure where everyone is. It's one of the good things about exploring the Gothic Quarter in Barcelona. So if you walk around, a few minutes later, you'll end up in a square and in it they'll have, you know, coffee shops, restaurants. It's a lovely place. It's just quite nice. As it's the weekend, I think there must be a market here today. As you can see, everyone is just getting their stalls ready. So I'm now in Plaza Catalunya, which is this massive square at the end of La Ramblas. So if you walk from the statue of Christopher Columbus all the way up to the end of La Rambla, you'll end up here. There's also a marathon or half marathon happening here, which explains why most of the streets were shut today. I've just spoken to one of the organizers of the marathon and she said that it's a full marathon and it's called Carrera de la Mujer. So you can see this is one of the main streets of the city and it's shut today.
So I'm now in um, La Sagrada Familia. Last time I was here, I didn't have the budget to go inside. So I thought this time around, I'll spend a bit and yeah, check what's inside the cathedral. I didn't actually know the ticket situation here, so I got here an hour early, but they wouldn't let you in until the time that's stated in your ticket. So I'm just gonna walk around this area and <laughs> have a look at the, um, the building. That was incredible. The colors coming out from the stained glasses it looks amazing. You do feel like you're in a forest. Let's move to our next stop, which is the Plaza de España. Taking a metro ride to Plaza de España. Welcome to Plaza de España. So the marathon that we saw earlier, it ends here. So you see loads of people. So I'm gonna go towards the top of the hill so that I could get a much better view of all the surrounding area. So now I'm on my way to the Olympic Stadium. We should get a really nice view of Barcelona from there as well. So that is the Olympic Stadium. And I think that's part of it as well. <laughs> it looks incredible. I actually don't know what else to do here. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna walk around and um, see if there's anything interesting I've not seen yet.
It is so unusually hot today. It's November, but we're like 22 degrees at the moment. I'm actually surprised that they're just letting people in without having to pay. This is quite good of them. If you're anywhere else, you would have to pay entrance fee, right? <laughs> So according to my watch, I've walked around eight miles so far today. So my legs are starting to feel it. <laughs> so instead of walking to the top of this mountain, Mount Joik, I think it's called, um, I've decided to take the cable car. And oh my God, the, the view is incredible. You'll see almost the entire city. Just beside me, there, that's the castle of Montjuic or Montjuic. Um, as usual, I don't want to pay to get in. Can anyone admire it from far, from the outside? So, yeah, so I'm just gonna walk around it and um, also enjoy the view of the city. I'm now back in La Rambla area and I was gonna have lunch at the Bocaria but then it's shot <laughs> I think because it's Sunday so that's everything for me from Barcelona I hope you like this video and if you do please click that like button and subscribe if you haven't already and if you haven't checked my other videos, I've created a playlist on my channel. Go check them out. Share them with your friends. It's the best way to help the channel. I'll be back in the spring and I will see you there. Kita kids, or as you say in Barcelona, fins dispress.